Cállate a la verga. <laughs> Más bien. Have you guys ever seen a podcast where you got this guy going... You guys. Got, got like that going crazy. Yeah. Our fans in the comments. And that's the thing. Delos. But that's look at... Look cállate, at, por favor. <laughs> déjame hablar. Jesús <laughs> bendito. Deja ya. See, that's how I felt. That's how I felt. I was like, yeah, cállate. I'm a mic. I dare you. Oh, yeah, you did. All right, guys. Guys, look. Comment down below. I mean, my... All right, guys. <laughs> <laughs> guys, guys, <laughs> guys. Grab a city, grab a city. Comment, comment down below. Back it. <laughs> no, 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 Turn on the camera. Turn on the camera. <laughs> guys. Drop him. No. <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome to the Agosto Papa podcast episode number 29. Guys, I know today we were supposed to upload Esteban Gabriel, but we didn't do it. <laughs> <laughs> I chill, Gazelle. We didn't do it because... We um, didn't promote it. Because that's we like, didn't promote it. We were, we were busy. So we wanted to upload it the right way. Fuck, that's not my camera. But anyways. um, So yeah, I'll upload it next week for sure. No lags. Like I think So wait on the teasers this week coming up on Instagram and TikTok. You love being teased, huh? All his relationships are about to. Damn. <laughs> he doesn't get past the talking stage. Tease. It's all good. No. Yeah, guys. Um, Damn, you're going in. Make sure you guys buy our merch. Agustababa.com. New drop coming soon. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be fire. This is going to be the hottest shit And ever. new set coming soon as well. <laughs> oh, my God. We're going to leave this humble place. Also, I think starting... When? Next week, we're going to be back on Twitch. <sighs> no, not next week. Because next week is Esteban. Back but next, next week. Yes. Back on Twitch. In two weeks. So make sure you subscribe to our Twitch channel at <laughs> Sopaba <laughs> slash <Christopher> Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you're going to go your whole life with your voice cracking. Like, you're going to be like 60. Nah, I'm going to get all that shit. Dude, imagine when you say, Why well, Angel can fix oh, your voice cracks. Wait, you're talking about when someone puts something all the way down here? Or what? No. Yeah. <laughs> no. I think that's called a deep throat. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, I'm waiting till I get the Gaga 3000. <laughs> like, Dude. I heard that one cleans your vocals good. Your voice is going to crack when you say, I do. No, imagine. I already jinxed it. No. Man. I already jinxed it. No. <laughs> that's, that's, I would crack over at your wedding. You're like, I would walk <laughs> off. I'd walk off. Yeah. yeah, I think you guys will get married, but you anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what are we, what's the topics today? Oh, oh yeah. The We're talking about Ivan Cornejo, Danny Lux, Slavon Gabriel. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> hey, who's that? <laughs> Where the fuck is that like, shit up? I mean, it's like, I don't know, dude. I don't know. I don't know. It's, oh, yeah, yeah. It's Lavon Gabriel. <laughs> so one armado. They had a kid or what? <laughs> oh, at the end of this episode, we're going to do a funny Q&A. Like, we guys... Whoa, we told you guys to ask us questions on Instagram. And we got a lot of funny ones. No, you just got funny ones for me, huh, bitch? <laughs> oh, yeah, a lot of them So, you. if you want to know the answers to all those questions, you have to stay to the end of the video. Yes. Or oh, oh, yeah, <laughs> and give this video a thumbs up if you support us. And huge shout out to Slavon Armado for inviting us to Brian Tovar's 18th birthday, birthday party. It was lit as fuck. Yes, it was sir. cool. Me he echó unos pinches dos tacos a la verga. Oh, yeah. ¿Qué esos tacos? I ate like six, wey. Seven, eight. Keiko said, what? They're already free? Yeah. Hey, okay, guys. Have to pay? Huge shout out to Slavon Armado. Huge shout Expect out to them on the record. podcast soon once we get the new set. And we're going to have their prints on, too. And what? Their, their parents? Oh, yeah. And then another episode with their parents. They said they were down. Oh, yeah. And we met Angel. And Angel Levia, dope. Danny, Danny Lux, too, pretty soon. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely, yeah. Uh, Dude, stop treating on your fucking nose. <laughs> 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 like a fucking giraffe. <laughs> you know how a giraffe when they, uh... <laughs> hey, no, that's a new mixer, homeboy. You can't put it there. Just put it... Angel has top. napkins. I'm gonna oh, just yeah. swallow it. Yeah. Right, no, right. when you shit, it's gonna fucking get stuck in. What the sauce con huevo instead of... Here. Here. Oh, shit, there's a spider on the napkin. Oh, yeah, he's scared of spiders. He's girl. I'm flat-footed. Got Ivan Cornejo. Oh, um, congratulations to Ivan Cornejo because he's number one on... Well, was number one on the Latin chart. Yeah, for a little while he hit number one. But we the were, song Está Dañada. That's just fucking <laughs> crazy. We were thinking that he might be the youngest one to Speaking have to your mic, mic oh. porfa. Fuck <laughs> it, he like... Like, fool, the mic's right <laughs> my here. My bad, my bad. Uh, he might be the youngest one to hit uh, number one on the Latin charts. Hell yeah. Well, not the... Mm, in the Latin, Latin charts, Latin. In the, regi in the regional. In the regional. In the regional, yeah. Yeah. Could be. 
Yeah, yeah. honestly, 17. I, I don't even know any other artists that did that. Wait, wait, nope. No, I didn't just. Wait, what? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> just say it. Just say it. Just say it. <laughs> we were Islamon was on yeah. the charts when they were young, right? Young too. It yeah. might have been like yeah. Oh, never mind. Bye bye. Ivan Corona. Show me. Show. Hey, put my mic up a little bit, no? No, I already hear you way too much. No, yeah. Oh yeah, you're much. right. They were turn it down or put my headphones right? on. Yeah. Then we were like, hey, we should see that. The <laughs> <laughs> we should have done our research. Oh, yeah, there I was has thinking, to be someone else. There has to be someone. I, else. I was thinking about fucking. Oh, like, well, he's just turned eighteen. And Who? Last year, Pedro was. No, that's what I'm saying. Pedro was probably like eighteen. No, he did no. it at seventeen. Seven, seventeen. Mm-hmm. I think he did it at seventeen. He yeah, turned eighteen I mean, this year. Still not shabby. Well, oh, one of the youngest ones. All right, one of the youngest ones. Change of change of award. <laughs> one of the youngest. <laughs> it was the youngest when I was one of the youngest. Tied. Because yeah. I don't think anybody's under 16. Yeah, he just seems so much younger. I don't know why. Don't yeah. know. And at the time of right now, he's number 49 on the US charts. United States. Think about it. Nation. De los Nation. Wait, is he first in Manzana to be number one? Yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. Manzana Records? Yeah. A Manzana Records, yeah. Tony has never been Tony Lee has never been number one? No. Nah. I don't think no? so. <laughs> he made it to like Angel number like, nah. <laughs> 16, I think, was the highest. Damn. I could be wrong. Six. Yeah, I think you're wrong because I don't think you know <laughs> your facts. What about you, Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Shit. That's like, you know, she's trending. No, Jenny69, she could probably have been on the charts. She's you know? like 45. Mm. Oh, no, she, she was number one, one trending on YouTube. Oh, on yeah, YouTube, there you oh, go. trending on YouTube. But yeah, congrats. What about um, Jason Nunez? I think he hit charge, no, for the charge. For charge? The most charge. Jason Shushesh. No, he hit he hit charge. What about Jason Shushesh? <laughs> <laughs> Who's that? Damn, you just your stage name should be JJ. No. Let, should I change the art? <laughs> no, J J J Nunez. Janus, like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like Jake Cortez. He's now verified on Instagram too. So congratulations. congratulations. Is he first in Manzana to be verified? I think so. I think so because Tony was Tony never verified on his account that he lost. He lost like because I think his, accounts. his current account he's like got thirty five k and he's not verified. Oh yeah, he Damn. started all over, huh? Wait, is there like a level where you had to hit? To no, be no, it's just like no, you don't. Hey Pepe, get a certified. What the hell? Certified. I mean, verifying. <laughs> <laughs> like certified. Why? Idiot. Why? I want to know why you yeah, want to get why? verified. Why? You always yeah. tell us, I want to get verified. Why? Yeah. Why? Yeah. Tell, tell, us, tell us the right reason why you want to get verified. If not, we'll no, tell them. So look at the camera. Look at why you want to get verified. <laughs> look at your camera. <laughs> your zone. It's right there. Why are you telling me to look? I was looking at my camera the whole time. It's because when I'm asking, I'm not allowed to Okay, go. Okay, tell me. Why do you want to be verified? So people, when I send out emails, I'm like, emails. <laughs> this is what Gago said Dude When we get verified Dude I'm gonna put so much bitch <laughs> 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 He did that right I did, like, did that, that, That's the real reason Hey I swear to god He did and what, what I, I swear to god too what, what, Yeah he did, what I, <laughs> yeah, he did. <laughs> stop, stop stepping on my shit You're cutting on my mic Alright let's put it right here Um <laughs> and what did I say when I when oh, we first started the podcast Oh yeah he's like No no cause I think we were talking about Like oh what What is our like Dream in life And he's like Fuck bitches, get, get money, money. <laughs> and get verified. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm still single, so no. Well, congrats okay. to Ivan Cornejo. <laughs> he's like, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> like, right now, she. Iva- <laughs> congrats <laughs> to Ivan Cornejo, because what else is happening with Ivan Cornejo? Dueto coming. S- oh, yeah. Dueto he- coming soon with um, Eslabon Armado. Damn. Damn. Hey, 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 the hey, hey, hey. baby goat, <laughs> Ivan Cornejo. Oh, yeah. The baby goat, baby goat. We're going to call him the with baby goat. With the medium goat. goat. So How do we gonna... found out? Because Pedro posted. Tueto con quien? And someone said Ivan Cornejo. And then he said, Se viene algo que no se imaginan. Fuck. Damn. Hey. Boy, that shit's gonna be knife that's fucking like in my arm, cutting all the way up. Corta vena, son. Corta vena, that's Crazy that's ass corta vena shit. Probably cut off a whole leg, too. Minus Wait, one. so you would get sad if you listen to it? No, I'm not. You, you're you probably gonna shed tears and fucking... <laughs> I'm telling you, if you listen to a sad I don't song, know like, you get sad. Yeah, I don't know if I mentioned it, but he cried during Twilight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Next topic. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Next like, that's it. <laughs> Like my bad for having emotions. No, like, but there's a lot of new songs coming out. Well, that Eslabon is taking out. They're taking out a new song. Album. And a new song with <laughs> <a> song. <laughs> <laughs> with Danny Lux. Is it a song or a whole album? I don't Both. know. Honestly. I think I saw a whole album. It's a whole album. Really? It's a whole album. Where'd you see it though? You just said it's a new song. I I, <laughs> I felt like I saw a song. <laughs> yeah. But he did post about <laughs> yeah, on his story, and I did not take a screenshot. 
Well, yeah, he I know, me too. I but it was on his story. He said he was going to take out a whole album with Danny Lux? No, no, no. No, no that. not he a whole that. album. It's like four no, I, songs. I don't know. Oh. I think they're going to be taking out songs for like a while. Like, who knows how many songs. I think they're going to be a lot. Yeah, because he says, Vienen muchas. Cause he, I thought I saw like an album. Too, you know, like, I might as well, dude. They're you just call them right that now. Fucking Jugaste y Sufri, that was a banger way. I'm pretty sure they can It didn't hit right away. The thing I was going to say, it didn't hit right away. Yeah. yeah. Because it's TikTok. TikTok way. TikTok, yeah. like changing yeah. up the because game. Because when I first you saw think that t- one, oh, go. I was like, who's Danny Lux? Because I thought he was the only feature in the whole album. Yeah. And then I, I liked it, but I didn't know it was going to be that big. Yeah. TikTok is fucking... TikTok help. I've been hit number one. Yeah. TikTok has the two sides. The the, foods that, the ones that support you and the... the, the madrosos. Madrosos. Why did you get told by <laughs> Jason's results? <laughs> oh. Oh. Chill out, Keko. Just wait till I recently list all my so music. Your jokes are over. So Slabon actually has a preview with Danny Lux. Oh, the end of uh, the song of Who Has So Free. And they played it live. And they played it live. I have it right here thanks to Keko. Or whoever sent me this. <laughs> You're welcome. And stop stepping on my shirt. What do you? Que no ha salido de ninguna parte, dice más o menos. Si supieras cuánto lloré, me dejaste bien dañado. Mis ojos You think this is gonna be a hit just like Who Wants to See Sufri? I hope so. Yes. It's because it's hard. And you to know what like TikTok's gonna be doing? I'm already sorry. They're gonna be at a party where um they're gonna be sitting like this. They're gonna record the girl like, Fui a la fiesta, yeah. And they're gonna be dancing and then, yeah. It's a whole TikTok video right there. What? Wait, what'd you say? What'd you say? <laughs> <No. Okay. laughs> what happened? You didn't understand yourself, huh? No, I didn't. He, he said I, I can't hear shit, wait. I can't hear shit, wait. Wait, 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 wait. There, okay. Okay, wait, let me say something. No, people wait, wait. get mad at us for... For like... For like no, people get making fun of Gecko? Yeah, no, it's because he's it's nervous like, and he's playing with my no, shit no, and it cuts me off. I'm talking about something. You said, oh, I'm flipping on it, so I picked it up and like, like, tengo right here. Yeah, well, don't play with it. Dale. I'm not... Wait, so... Dude, people get mad because we fuck with Gecko, but like... He literally says some shit. He's like, "No, I didn't understand myself either." <laughs> so it's like, <laughs> he did. He does that a lot. Like, dude, actually, last uh, we were talking about last episode a little bit too. No. Last last episode, we kind of no. like, um, <laughs> not hate, but, but like, oh, they got some people. Now nah, it's like two people. They got mad about the Cheto shit. Oh yeah. Well, someone, someone commented on Instagram too, like, y'all shouldn't be hitting on upcoming artists. <laughs> <laughs> like, shit. Like, shit. But, 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 no, 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 no. no. <laughs> if you know, but, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, but, like, yeah, we, were, we weren't hating on Cheto. No, like, either way, it's publicity. <laughs> People are going to want to know, oh, who's this food, Cheto? And they're going to go on YouTube and put Cheto. <laughs> I mean, um, um, whatever his name is. Yeah. And then we weren't hating though, because I mean, guys, if you guys watch our podcast, we just joke around, and I feel like that's what makes us unique. Cause like with Chata, Ch- Chafana El Cano? Yeah, like we. That for getting a shitload of. He got 10,000 followers. Because well, of us. Yeah, because we, we were making fun of them, but it's just like they're jokes. Yeah. yeah. But then again, like I feel like people don't even understand, like, the. like the, Sarcasm the, issue. The, yeah, like our style. Like, yeah, we could go like. Well, explain me. We could go like one one in one conversation, like for example, really good, like really good. Oh yeah, it's really good. Next topic, like you also like need to have fun with the topics too, you know. And I feel if like just gonna, we're, we we do yeah. that the best way in terms of like the style, like mm-hmm. it's uh, it's our style, you know. And I feel like some people understood it. Yeah, some people understood it. Like it's not as like serious as y'all think, you know. That like, you need to have fun with it too. Yeah, like, we we weren't hating though. Like obviously he sounds good. If we if we said he sounds like Chato. He 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 sounds good. Yeah. But anyway. that should be a compliment, not a fucking. No, but you got a lot hate. of hate. Why? <laughs> because of the shit that happened with like the Yuvia and all that stuff. Oh, I was drunk. I don't know what happened. <laughs> <laughs> no, hey, he always got a way to dodge it. <laughs> and Angel got some love for once. Oh, I yeah. know. Hey, how do you feel? How Wait, you feel? I thought I did good. I didn't do good. No, with remember all those screenshots I was sending you? The, the messages we were getting? Oh, I know. What the hey, fuck? Hey, I hey. saw that shit sober and I was like, what the fuck, dog? Like, <laughs> I thought I was fucking spreading you fags. No, you were to, this, to a certain extent. You even get hated on Instagram. Like when you posted the food. Oh, yeah. That was <laughs> oh, funny. Oh, yeah. fuck. Giggle took, took a picture of his plane. Someone called him puto panzon. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but what do you feel, Angel, that like, people are... <laughs> 
you know, <laughs> they're responding to you good. Mm. Even some people that used to hate you. Yeah, like, people oh, used shit. to like hate you. Like they're, what do you feel? Fool? Well, now just thanks Morgan. to everybody that watches, regardless of. If, uh, no, just regardless. Like, thank you for all the support, and just hate him better. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mind. Yeah, I, yeah. Hey, but I was gonna say something about the song. See, no, who I, Danny looks and shit. Yeah, I feel like I hope it hits, but I feel like it's really hard to duplicate the success yeah. of one song. I think that's but like, I'm pretty sure there's a lot of good songs that are gonna come out of that album yeah, or it's that. Gonna, that drop. I think it's up to TikTok. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but if you notice, know way like the most successful songs has to do with the lyrics and like how you could showcase it in a picture like for example ivan's su carita obviously the picture of the face sus manitas the picture of the nails and then everybody just started doing that and i feel like that's yeah. how it got to number one well really yeah, yeah, wait, but the song's good the song's good regardless well it says que fue a la fiesta de ayer, no? and then what about like you could put that and then the next day be like, the be like yeah <laughs> like like this, going to a, come going out, to a party and then like falling in love with a girl and then the next day like you guys go out to a day or dinner and that like it's all about yeah. the creative yeah, like, like how, how could we create the song and put it in a picture in a yeah. video and TikTok like that should be bad yeah see? so i mean i'm not really <coughs> on tiktok like damn fool i know what the fuck those fool. are new mics fool i that's my mic i put your name on it are you fucking like <laughs> sick or some shit no that is almost all of my gum <laughs> What were you gonna say, Angel? Before Gecko that. rudely coughed <laughs> on that mic. <laughs> Damn, you good? Yeah, full good. Dale. Yeah, that I'm not like that big on TikTok, so I hadn't seen like the video of like oh Sucarita like till today. Mm -hmm. I just thought that the song was like big and stuff because like it was actually pretty good. No, it is good and like makes you feel like. But that's just a plus. It's because he started crying, so he didn't. Yeah, feel like I was like, it has like makes you like feel something, you know. So I was like, yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> so, like, you... <laughs> nah, just kidding. Yeah, hell yeah. So, like, when you listen to a song... I know we already asked you this, Angel, but, like, let's just ask you, like, in the podcast. When you listen to a song, like, you actually feel, like... The emotions? Sad about it? Because I, I, I don't know. Like, you get the, your emotions get to you for, like... Or you song. have flashbacks of, like... So, like, if you're listening to, like... Flashbacks from Vietnam? You're listening to, like, Narco Corrido for you take a line of yeah, coke I, and you do all oh, that. no, no. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, like, you know you listen to like Luis Enrique Conrique see, yeah, it's you feel pumped bien bellico, you know but then you listen to some sad cuss stuff and you don't feel the same you know it makes you like feel like, some certain way really? come on you guys in the comments like back me up like <laughs> okay <laughs> so, like, <laughs> guys, but like you know you listen to like like you know Ivan Corno yeah him and like you feel a certain way you know it's not the same as like listening to I feel like when I listen to like mother sad cuss shit like it just makes me feel like, like, damn, this shit goes hard, but yeah. I don't feel like sad. Yeah, me neither. Like, I don't, I don't cry. Like, no, I mean, I don't cry either. But you said you cried to a rap, a sad rap song. Oh yeah, you cried to a sad when? rap song. You, when? you cried to Twilight. Like fake land. The second. I, think I wasn't crying though. Yeah, and you were like, like Jacob and Edward. <laughs> 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 no, but like, has emotions. You know, it makes you. Yeah, I mean, some people like you. Come on, guys, back me up. <laughs> no, no, uh, I mean, I'm just saying that's how I feel. Like, like the, the, I feel like there's only <laughs> one song that made me feel like sad, like not sad, but like holy fuck, that shit's crazy because of like the storyline. It's called uh, El, Vago? El Vago, yeah, I should oh, El, Va El, Va yeah. El, Va yeah. I should cry. El Vago, and um, what I thought you said, you know, no, but that was different. Oh, yeah, El Vago, and this song called Dancing with the Devil. Oh, by the way, let's say, uh, oh, yeah, let's say El Vago, not the oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Bye, uh, Chavalo de la Perla. That's what I was yeah. thinking. Yeah. 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 I mean, you're crazy. <laughs> you guys <can't. laughs> like, and I'm the weird one. Hey, check out that song. It's really badass. And it, it was By based who? on like a true story. Like, uh, Did uh, he was the devil? No, no, the other one. The devil? Oh, oh yeah. that's... Oh, it, it that's was written yeah. to someone that... The, actually dancing with the devil is the one that guy talks about like killing his mom? Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. No, yeah. that's... Just, that shit's crazy. Wait, wait what? Oh, there was this... There's this song called Dancing with the Devil and I was saying that, like, it actually got to me where, like, the guy, he... It's like a rap song. No, he no, went, like, I, I just said, oh, like, oh, what? To, like, he kills his mom? Like, yeah, because he gave was, that reaction out. Like, in oh, other words, like, shut up. I was gonna explain it. it. All right, but I was going to explain it to you. Damn. No, and that's no I was listening. To. I was listening, but then when you said, like, he killed his mom, like, you know, like, oh, what the fuck? Like, yeah, he killed, he you, killed you his mom. Like, 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 what the fuck? Like, then like, was telling you, like... Then, yeah, he was explaining it to you. And I was explaining to you because that's all you know. Now you know nothing. Oh, sorry. Listen, I don't want to explain it. <laughs> <laughs> I looked at you right away, guy. Like, oh, shit, I don't know if I'm gonna say it right. All right, guys, what's up, guys? We're back from the break. You know, we had to take a little puff, puff, pass oh break. God, right there. <laughs> um, Angel, your bitch. <laughs> Kidding, Angel. If you could do a sad cut hour dueto, who would it be? <laughs> a sad cut hour dueto. Yeah. 
How do you pronounce Assignment it? Assignment. How do you pronounce it? <laughs> How would you phrase it? It's like when my when I step so on my dog on? and accident. Well, there's a chart behind Angel since you're like the softest person in the group. <laughs> softest what? <laughs> Bitch. Yeah, the softest person. Not because you're allergic to grass and stuff. But I play tennis and the choir. And I didn't make it. Choir, Damn, because this is like the sad cut. Sing for la la la. Go, go, go for it. Damn. Six artists right here. If I can get them all to hop on the verse in one single song, I'd really like. Well, two won't be possible, but. All right, you, you have to choose three <laughs> to make you cry, like. Like, like shit, the dude. Banger, make me cry? Like, yeah. Yeah, like. Three. Well, th- first, three. just to get it out of the way, I'd really like a song with Marco Mepen is Labon. You know? Me. But. These two over here already have a song cry? together. Who's going to make you cry? But to make me cry. I remember when Ivan was here, he was saying that he really wanted a dueto with... Well, Ivan's not here, so... When he was <laughs> here. Uh, but that's it. Ivan. We want your thoughts. <laughs> Déjame hablar. <laughs> no, with, ya se me olvidó with Ed Maverick. No, wait, like, I he said he wanted a song with Ed Maverick. No, that, that would make... So much. Ivan and Ed Maverick? Yeah. And yeah. Junior Ache Who's already did person? that. Who's the third person? On what? I said three. Three artists already. And a song together. The two on the left have a song together. I already know who I'm going to choose. Eh, 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 eh. Me too. Actually, it's kind of hard. Me three. Nah, I already know perfectly. Nah, actually, I, I know. I know. Me too. Go enjoy yeah, it. I'm already just crying. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like saying, oh, this guy and this guy. I'm like, would I cry? Mm. How about you guys go? And I'm, well, like, no, no, right. I'm go, go Jason, go I would go Junior H, Ivan Cornejo, and Eslabon. That's my three right there. That's kind of what I was thinking too, but I'm debating between Danny Lux and Ivan Cornejo. But uh, they, uh, it's because uh, they're both remarkable artists. Or, I think I want to go with the top three. I don't know. Just looking at, I'm just. I'm I know there's so yeah. much. You would get Eslabon Junior Ache has to be in there for sure. What? You would get Eslabon out. Do you choose the top three? Yeah, something new. Yeah. What is the opinion? Right, something new. Junior H, Marca Me Pen, Slavon. Three big dogs. Well, look, think about it. Uh, Junior H, and eh, those fools have a song already. Espérate, wey, deja hablar. Oh, these fools. <laughs> Junior H <laughs> and Chato already have a song together, which is, it was good. And just Slavon. Pretty sure they could fuck Porte shit up. Diferente and Danny Lux. Oh, yeah, something that would be Something that would, good. like, different. might not happen, but, yeah. Yeah, Obviously, say, oh, no. Some other group did it. Um, Alta Elegancia. Did well, honestly, uh, Porte Diferente and Junior H have a song together. Well, that's that's cool. what I've been saying for like the past I three just, minutes. That song, I really liked it. I just didn't like. <laughs> what do you call it when when they don't like record it good? Oh, the audio was bad. Yeah. That <laughs> no way, no mames. No, don't say that. <laughs> wow. Yeah, the audio was pretty bad because Junior H. <laughs> JD hates like, us because of you. Boring. We're gonna have to find a way to because he cut you off. No, and, and then we can't bully you because. Okay. Go Angel, I think you were gonna say something important. Yeah, that song's really good. Just the audio, like sometimes like messes like they lacking it, huh? Songs up. You could tell when audio is bad, way no cap. Yeah, I mean I don't know anything about that, but the song like sounded like it was like they sent his verse on the phone. Honestly. Like, oh yeah, like, I remember. Oh, you that. oh like, like Bobby Schmurder and a six nine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like that because like I feel like they're at the studio and, like hey like so we have the microphone like just say something. <laughs> no, the oh, person. Dude, there's a lot of songs that I do listen to. That like the audio is not that good. Like for them to be big artists, I always think like they. All right, like, give them, especially well, throw it out me, there. Throw for it out me, there. like who? there's a lot of artists who with the bajo loche, that and then it. like it, the bajo loche sounds like a tolo loche. Yeah, you're right. And I like the one that's like putazo. Like yeah, you know, I'm like like you know what song had like amazing, amazing, amazing mixing and mastering. Uh, Con tus besos. Uh. The new one. The new like one. That. Yeah, that shit was you think badass, bro. Badass, like badass mixing and mastering. Like, yeah, I don't know who did that, but you did a fucking Just a little background job. right here. We have like some professional mixing and mastering people. So, no, Jason. I've been kind of learning, but <laughs> they're like, oh, this song needs a little bit of this. This song is like, <laughs> no, honestly, it, it's, it's, it's an eye opener. I thought it's like, it's an opinion, you know, like a lot of people like the, you know, the, the bajo loche to sound poppy and other people like it to sound flat. It's, it really depends, you know. Do you think they like it or just wherever they take? Like, no, I'm pretty sure you could tell the engineer, like, hey, I want it to sound this, 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 this. Like, I feel like every artist mm-hmm. should, like, really but I feel know like what they want to sound it like. It doesn't happen like that. Like, I just want, like, worried about something else. So yeah, yeah, the engineer le pone a little sauce. Yeah. Well, yeah, at the end of the day, is the engineer better. Like, if you know what you want to sound like, then. 
Yeah. But the song with Junior H, I'm Puerto Diferente, I'd like to get it like redone. Yeah, it's not going to get redone. All right, so <laughs> Angel from Agusta but wants it redone. You think we can make that happen? <laughs> 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 We're going to start a GoFundMe page. <laughs> not a GoFundMe, the petition.org. Petition. Petition. GoFundMe? <laughs> <laughs> this fool. Hey, they had to fund the song. Fool, that shit's expensive, I bet. Studio time. But hey, yeah, wait, I was gonna ask you guys something. You know how like this taco? Oh, actually, it was your question. You want to ask the taquachi shit? <laughs> oh, with Ivan? What? Uh, no, just no taquachi shit. You know how you were like, hey, you, yeah, I'm gonna just ask. Yeah, it. ask. It. Angel said <laughs> he told <laughs> us earlier. Perdido. I told him to say over the podcast, but he said, "Do you guys think this taquachi shit is dying out?" Oh no, yeah, because when Ivan hitting number one, I was like, some people say like it's dying out, but the music is you know hitting number one. Yeah. So do you guys, where do you guys see it going? Do you guys, what like, like the whole culture, you know, like the way they dress, like the trucks. I like feel you guys like. see that like evolving, dying out? Well, I feel like the trucks was always big. It's always part of the culture. And I don't think it'll like die out. But I think like the, just the tak watch it like. The no kemaka, like sad cut hours type shit. Like when it was big, it was big like, kind of when we first started the podcast, no? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, well, honestly, we, we put. Number one, Takwachi. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no, I, I put that, but you know, it's a good marketing. But we tool, never, right? yeah, but we never, like, we're not Takwachi. Like, really we don't just, we, like, we don't only have artists on here. And oh, yeah, yeah, We you're never right, said yeah. we were just a music. Yeah, yeah we, we don't have, have TikTokers, we YouTubers, have TikTokers, and we don't even have a pair of boots. And then, like, we're not when we, well, yeah, when we get the new, uh, boots, <laughs> when we get the new warehouse, we have a lot of YouTubers lined up, hell yeah, ready to go. We even lost our Takwachi. But yeah, I think we should go back to the question. Do you think it's going to die out or there's going to be a new trend? I think it's already already dying out. Yeah. But I'm just glad we're prepared. Bet. That's good. But like... we were Remember, we were prepared since the first episode. Remember I told you? Yeah. Like, we got to be ready. We can't just be music. Yeah. But now we, our first guests were TikTokers. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But yeah. like, when you mean taquachi, yeah. you mean like guitar music or no? No, or you just like, mean like, like the Nokia like machine, the, kind of the, the mole. No, the mole is has been for a while too. Yeah, but it got cool. brought back. Because I, I feel, feel like, like that, I, mm. I feel like that's just holding up. I feel like it's life. a very like, like this question. It, it depends. It really on, depends what uh-huh. you consider taquache shit. You know? Yeah, yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Because taquache shit, or actually like music and all that quemando shit, like all the trucks event was already going on. Yeah, the trucks were already big. Yeah, and the moles were big too. Back yeah, then. but then. People started be like, "Oh, that's that quachi shit," and then the next thing you know, it just became the trend. So then now, like little by little, that that phrase of saying like, "Oh, that quachi this, that quachi that," died out. But like that quachi music too, I feel like that was a phrase for a bit, no? Yeah. Well, that yeah, quachi like, music is regular. I feel like, like the norteño, no? like the no quema <laughs> like that's gonna norteño. die out. <laughs> but I just hope that like way. the culture stuff like doesn't die out, just evolve and. We keep getting like really good music. Then yeah, become awesome. Cause I I feel like um, you know I'm just maybe this might be like a prediction, but like if you notice the people that are playing like the group of Firma Lady, <laughs> <laughs> not that deep, bad, <laughs> but like the people that are playing guitar music are dressing like rappers, like Jordans. Fuck, that's, yeah. that's like that's like codiciado style. Yeah, but like they don't dress like rappers. You know, I feel like rappers don't wear designer they wear like like their own brand like they got their own design image. yeah like they got their own image like they got their own like well, people that make their clothes well, rappers for them. already on the on the next one because you know rappers like made designer cool yeah yeah, and yeah. i think that like the the watch like mexican and what, okay. like the younger ones are gonna start dressing a little bit like rappers like chains like yeah the, that's what i'm saying yeah, gonna, they might leave like the boots behind the yeah antes but it's being different like People were dressing in full suits. You don't see rappers fucking going out on stage. Yeah, because it's no, a different. It's a different. <laughs> thing. No way! I think you fucked up. I've never seen a rapper wear a suit. That's why I'm saying, like, but like, I just that, nodded like, my head. I was like, yeah, like you got that. the newer generation. It's different. Like, no, no, it's como like the new generation not in boots and all that shit. They're dressed like codiciado style, like yeah. with designer, oh, well, with like, like Gucci's um, and all that shit. Like wild. Yeah, that Gecko called that codiciado style. By the way. Yeah, that, uh, so when, we all call it, when I say rapper yeah. style, he like, says kind of Kodiya, he says Kodiya style. Que but yeah, like I think that's where it's gonna start going. Like that's gonna be, that's kind of crazy though. Like more streetwear. Like, that's pretty cool, honestly. Like someone has a fucking guitar and then they're all dripped out, which is it's already happening. But yeah. like it's remember, only bound to be pushed more towards that way. Remember when we were in a grupo and then some like lady 
or a dyke or someone came up to us. <laughs> and she was like, oh, next time you guys come, like, come in, like, a sombrero and shit. We're yeah. Like, oh, like, that's not us. Like, like yeah, we still play, like, that old school music, but. It's oh, just, really? She told you? Yeah, she's like, no, pero, like, se van a ver. Like, she wanted us to come out padrino and shit. Yeah, like a fucking, you like, remember, a right, suit and shit. Yeah. Yeah. We didn't, like, shut up and shit. Yeah. And we're like, oh. It's like, no, no se ven pre- presentables. Yeah. Like, yeah. It's because like, too old, no como digo, like, la, older people, they grew up seeing their artists. Yeah, it, still, it, was, it was like look, Tucan and shit, like they still wear suits in yeah. the presentation. And I feel and like then, that's never going to change for them. Yeah. That's why when like they see Morros fucking in regular streetwear, they're like, nah, it's from Bago, like no some musicals yeah. and this and that. Also, too, like some artists go up in backpacks. Wait, what? Back- oh, yeah. Like, oh, yeah. Some artists go up in. Like, there's Elemento. Yeah, like yeah, Polo and stuff like that. They go up in backpacks. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, yeah I feel like that's uh, a new I thing. I think no? Chris was one of the first people yeah, that I've seen. I think that's the first yeah. one. Went up in a backpack. Um, but, like, it's always evolving, you know? Like yeah. Some things like, are going in, some things are on the way out. You're right. We got to adapt to that new No, 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 generation. no, no. I, I think a, a new trend that... Not trend, but, like, I'm starting to see is people going up in ski masks. Oh, because yeah. of COVID, too. Like, no! no! <laughs> <laughs> you did that shit on purpose. You did that shit on purpose. Hey, JD was the first one to do a ski mask for the, the regional, regional, right? For the regional, know. yes. Yeah. Because motherfuckers be like, no, rapper was always doing it. Remember, they be they be getting on our ass. Like, if we don't yeah, say well, one word, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, yeah, it, rappers would do it, but like, JD. Yeah, because I think the one that. The regional, yes. Yeah. Takes credit like, for that. Even know rapping is a uh, Push Ice thing. And huh? then that's. That's how, like... Pushaisti? Yeah, I think that's his name. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, Pushaisti. Yeah, I think he, like, killed someone nice in jail. Pupu? Se fue pupu. Did you see the answer pupu? No. Yeah, but anyway, so, yeah, they, they'll ski mask thing. I oh. think it was cool. I like, oh, and then J.O.P. It did it, too? Oh, yeah, J.O.P. Oh, yeah, did, did it, too? Yeah, now everyone is going, like, to the tocadas with their Gucci flip-flops and, like, their Balenciaga slides. Fu- and ski masks. So I don't know, think I've seen anyone go on slides, but... I think I saw... Y si se tropiezan? No, maybe, maybe you're right. Maybe, maybe that could be the next trend. <laughs> Tropezarse? I think no, J- no. With I the think slides. JD is someone who really like sets the trends too in the region. Man. Yeah, it's just all about influence, fool. Mm-hmm. Like whoever is hitting and gets influenced by some someone, something, or someone around that genre and brings it here. It's only people are like only bound to follow it. Especially like the younger kids. <laughs> yeah, because of COVID. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, like, no, but you never know. It, it could, it could be. I think that was part of like why they started doing it because they're like, oh, instead of a mask, I'm gonna wear like you know the regular blue mask. Mm-hmm. I'm a ski mask, and, like it looks more badass. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, part of it. Because COVID, COVID is dangerous. Coronavirus. Wait, no, mames. Well, you're gonna say something, say something, firme. <laughs> nah. <laughs> okay, what what do you think is gonna be the next trend? Like, if you were to take one wild guess, what is the next trade? Chalecos like, antibalas. Like rollerblades. Well, that was a <laughs> a trend too. Yeah, not that like, they they're not gonna wear in a shirt a shirt under and just gonna wear the vest. I mean, I don't think it today. You think it will it keep is? changing, or it's just gonna like you're saying everything's going towards like rap. I think it's gonna adopt that a little more. Like it's gonna be way less like, adapt, not adopt. I remember in the Tony Loy episode, Keiko <laughs> said that. Um, remember he said that like corridos were gonna be bigger than rap. It, oh no, it is. no, no, no! It is. Oh yeah, but if it's turning that. into rap, like Tony Loy, Tony Loy told you, if it's turning into rap, then that's making rap bigger. Yeah. No. Yeah, he did. No. Yeah, he told because you. Then, he told you. Because, oh yeah. Because you're because, like, all right, shut the fuck up. He like cut that out. Remember? Because, because. Dude, if okay, we can we can go at it all yeah, night, bitch. Talk, let him talk. I let think we go talk. at it all night. We're already talking I mean, about let it. Him talk, so. We're yeah, he already got proof. Prove your point on the quicks. No, that's it. Game over. <laughs> nah, because he knows he didn't want to end up like yeah. the last episode, <laughs> dude. No, but what a kicko that fool! I was speechless. He was like, "All right, cut, cut that out. <laughs> all right, then then fight your argument." Nah, because we didn't go hour for this. Shit. That's fine. Like okay. you said, that's fine. All right, uh, we'll uh, fight uh, it. Hey, the podcast cool. is one hour. It's it's adapting way. Okay. You're like you're saying you're going more towards rap, but yet rappers are doing collabs with um Mexican people. Meaning, rap I like is getting bigger. I like seeing that. No, artists are getting big. Mexican the Mexican industry is getting bigger. Yeah. The Mexican industry is getting bigger because it's turning more like rap, and rap is an American thing. 
So make it, it makes rap big. Like it's not gonna be like no. Tony like, Loya said that to you. Like a uh, Mexico no. and like you know states thing. I think it's gonna be more like global now. No, it is global. Cause how they wanna take the look. The only thing, the only thing that they used against me was that we're past that. And and <laughs> but well, I'm bringing that. it up <laughs> that everybody li- like they listen to Drake in China and uh, yeah. But every in school, China? every school teaches English. If school would have teach Spanish, it would have been a but whole they different. Don't. But they don't. <laughs> yeah, but it's a whole different topic. That's the only reason. Thing. That's okay. no way. Okay, 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 okay. Wait, wait, I'm the moderator. I'm wait, the order wait, the court. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, 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 okay. I plead your thing. No, 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 no. I plead the thing. No, I'm not. No, whatever. Whatever. When the judge doesn't talk. Okay, go, 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 go. No, before I forget. Before I forget, you piece of shit. I already forgot. You fucking killed it. All right, all right. Let me see. No, no, no. I remember when you were saying. on that side. He said that they listen to Drake all over the world because they teach English. Bah. So, huh? Yeah. So if they were to teach Spanish all over the world, it would be a whole I, I different thing. thing. But they don't. But they don't. Okay, okay but so that's his argument. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But my argument. You, okay. My okay. argument. You already, okay. What's, your, argument. Letter, what's your argument? What's your argument? Okay. That if Spanish, I mean, if English wasn't a worldwide no, like, language, that, before that, like wait, you're saying that wait, is, wait, I know how to prove it. Wait, wait, wait. You do it or me? Wait, you do it. Half and half. Both of you. Half. That the only reason why rap is hitting is because english they, is a more gro- global language yeah okay if, yeah. if, if spanish was <laughs> but it obviously yeah it, obviously it is not because english is more global than, than spanish no yeah you're putting it yeah but, a, oh, you, uh, as a what if yeah but what is what matters is what is yeah. not what if well, yeah what is so you're saying okay and just like let me explain a little bit better so keko said that the mexican music is gonna be bigger than rap, like the corridos and stuff like that, right? Yeah, like that's but, cool. but we're saying that the corridos are turning more like rap, meaning rap is getting bigger. So you're saying no, the only reason that is because like rap, like Drake is worldwide, right? Mm-hmm. Like you listen, like you said, they listen to it in China and shit. Mm-hmm. And you said if they would have taught Spanish, mm-hmm. like how they teach English, it would be big, but they don't. Mm-hmm. So like Jason said, that's a what if. Yeah, that's not the reality. You're just saying if, but. A lot of people are starting to like that. Yeah, like you said, I don't take that right away now. from you. All right, so you guys both later on, exposed your arguments. But, you, and now but I maybe if everyone, they, I want to ask everyone, what is it going to take for Spanish music to be all over the world? Do they need to teach Spanish in I think so. classes? Yes, you had to teach yeah. it everywhere. I think it's just like the vibe. Cause like I seen, I like they're saying there's a lot of job opportun- opportunities. <laughs> But yeah, this could be even way more if they speak a double language could then become Wait, bilingual. But you know why? Yeah. You know why they teach? Well, one of the reasons why they teach English English all over the world is because, look, you come over here in the United States and there's a shitload of famous people. Like, that's part of the American Wait, what dream. does that have to do with? Yeah, what does that have to do with English? Because it's part of the culture. People love, people all over the world love the American culture. Oh, I see what People love American culture. Not really. <laughs> <laughs> you think you think people all over the world don't love the Tacuache culture? <laughs> That's Mexican, not English. <laughs> that was a joke. It was a joke. <laughs> what do you oh think, Angel? What do you think? What do you think, Angel? Like, if you were like, I, if we were in a court food and like you had to decide who's right, who's wrong, like who's taking the dub? I leave it up to you guys. You like, leave it. They're no, thinking. No, they're thinking, they're no, thinking no. about now. I'm thinking about the future. I know it's popping. It could be popping right now, but later on. Okay, okay. What was the question again? No, it's because so because Keiko said that the corridos are gonna be bigger than rap. Uh huh. Like meaning, like let's just say, for example, Tony Loya compared to Drake. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Okay, okay. okay. This is this is an example. In my opinion. You no, can. No, but they, no, you're uh, gonna say your okay, shit. Okay, but you're gonna say your shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah no, it's okay. Thing I ask. Okay, it's your opinion. Look. Go ahead. <laughs> how how much has the Mexican generation changed from then to now then as in when as in rap like i know i know what you mean i'll answer it um a lot because a lot of younger kids are listening to mexican music because they like it now it turns into it's like rap now there you go there there's a point but you're saying saying right now so then in the future obviously it has changed a lot when they fucking evolve or whatever you fucking word that shit, it's gonna change It's 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 gonna change you're right okay as to as to how fucking before Snoop Dogg and all the food now we got Drake it changed but yeah the Mexican music industry has changed a lot mm-hmm. and they gained a whole lot of fans yeah like younger fans yeah, yeah. so obviously they're 
the sons of these fans, they're going to fucking be listening to all that shit and it's going to be changing. We're going to have, now we have young, there's Number not a lot of young, there's not a young old? fucking, a lot of young wait, artists wait, in, wait, the, wait, wait, wait. in the rap. Yeah? I, I, no, yeah. There is? Who? No, hold up. Wait, who? who? A lot of young artists. Who? I don't really listen to it, but like, like there you Tekka, go. You don't listen to it. Wait, hold up. I, I was talking to someone Lil that Tekka told me that like sixteen or some shit. It was yeah, easier to pop. Fuck. Oh, at the part, the guy was saying that it's easier to pop in uh, Spanish because there's less competition. There's less competition because in rap, like you said, there's, it's saturated. It's again. super saturated because everybody rap. Everybody speaks English. No, no, no but I can put a whole sentence to, together and make a bar. You can't agree to that because that goes against your point. Yeah, that goes that. Like a <laughs> wait, 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 Culture no, I'm just saying that. Words. So you don't agree it's, that it's changing. That's why it's changing. What is it? But like not into rap. It's it's what is it? More into like, like what? He's stuck. Look at his stupid no. smile. Okay, like, let's use the herencia de patron as an example. Well, How do you compare first. like uh like Chalino to like herencia? Damn. Okay, this is tumbado and that was fucking. Okay, okay, like okay, 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 okay. Watch, 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 watch. Check this out. Okay, it doesn't even have to be rap. Okay, for example. Ivan Cornejo, oh, the, mm -hmm. he said that a big influence for him was alternative rock mm -hmm. what, in English. In English, what what does that contribute to? Rock. <laughs> it, it's still English music way. So, me, but like, it's not a rap way. Okay, you can have two different. But does it matter? You can have no, it, you can American have, culture. You way. can have jazz and you can have rap. And it's, it's the same shit. It's because it's English. It's English way. Everything is contributing contributing to English. And that's why English music is going to be bigger. Well, look, I don't know until, it's, it's, until it's when. A lot but it's changing a lot because of like the influence of these younger people. Do you yeah. make, do I make sense? Yeah, yeah. Well, like the, I said, the, I, I get you. And I hope the Mexican like yeah, me gets too. spread it like worldwide like you're saying. But you're like wait did you agree that um it's turning into rap or not? Whoa, why you keep saying that you just want me to say yes or what no i'm just saying yes or no you're saying like compared to back then to now 25 yeah it changed but like let's what, just say what like my, um well well my point i know no yeah just the whole my question. thing let's yeah just say like, yes but my yes, my point yes. is my point is yes, that it's gonna yes. overcome rap Okay, but you're saying no yes. other other shit. My point was this and that. So, okay, wait. you want me to wait. say yes, so then you can use that to no. say oh this 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 then this. Then say no. Then say no. No. So it's not turning into rap. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why are you paying for it? Because if I say yes, he's gonna hit me with Dude, that. Look, this, 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 you can do this, is stop this, talking this, right now this, this, because you know what's coming. Another trap. We're gonna take a break, but we're not done. <laughs> 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 All right, guys. Well, we're back from the break, and y'all were getting down. No, all of us. We were just going at it, but uh, so explain yourself. Because you said uh, well, the that the music, Mexican music, <laughs> Mexican <laughs> music, is not turning right. into rap. Okay, right? this is this. No, okay, no, but wait, 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 wait. But everybody's wait, gonna get to talk. Wait, 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 don't wait, wait, talk over everybody. Wait, wait, wait. Damn, you didn't even answer my I question. I feel like, okay, listen up, bitch. <laughs> it's your opinion. Oh, listen up, bitch. Wanna listen to it. It is, but it's gonna overcome rap, and it's gonna make it into its own style, and then um Spanish. Industry is gonna take over. So, um, the Mexican music industry is turning into rap. You said. Yeah, but it's gonna oh, you take said, over. Okay, it's gonna yes. yeah yeah yeah, but it's gonna take over. It's gonna take over rap, like mm -hmm. English rap. Mm -hmm. It's gonna take over. So since it's gonna like, take it like, over. Like, like let's just say the. It's gonna take his style, make it into his own bitch, and then boom. So like let's just say the example you said about Drake that they listen to it worldwide and even in China, mm -hmm. since they don't teach Spanish, like they teach English, how would the Mexican overbeat the English? The Out flow, the flow is catchy, <laughs> just like rap, right? Mm -hmm. So, but I was about to no, say no. I'm gonna back you up with my argument. <laughs> Wait, but after you said that, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how I could get. But like you said, how I could back you up. Everything is changing, right? Right. Yep. Yeah. And mm -hmm. the good thing mm -hmm. that, mm -hmm. like you do, uh -huh. and uh -huh. it has a good chance of changing a lot because I think that Mexican music had like a change that hasn't happened ever before. Where I think back then it was just like the parents listening to the Mex like the hardcore Mexican music, but now it's like the younger ones too, you know, like yeah, the the kids and the parents like listen to the same ones. Uh, I, I think well, I mean, like I feel like the older parents would listen to like 
like the old school like like what bookies say, and like shit like we, and we like Vicente Fernandez yeah but, like those like yeah but once once they corridos. started listening to it and then I'm pretty sure now like you guys fucking we ain't grow up listening to what well, we did but we knew about it but like we the, didn't grow up uh-huh. we didn't grow up watching it like, I mean, and then magic. now now you still listen to some of those songs and then they hit different what do you mean yeah, oh, yeah, like, yeah I get like like you listen to like those like like Saturday cleaning songs or whatever oh like, I now you like listen to it it's like it hits yeah it's, so I think that now that the younger Mexican audience like is a fan of that but they also listen to other genres you know like let's say rap you know, like how you said, like uh, Ivan said, alternative. So I think that's going to bring in like a different like flow, like a bunch of different like sounds that could take it like more global. And maybe they start doing it in China, how you said. But let's speak about like, like Bad Bunny. I'm pretty sure he gets played in China. Why do you think he puts in those? What is it? You know, but I know, but that's one song. We <laughs> That's one song that he one did. One song, one song can become five in the future. Oh, when he's. Uh, was speaking um Japanese. Japanese. The, you think like the Mexico, 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 Mexico. Me- Mexican music industry will be like like the corridos that we're talking. They use an example. Tony Loy, he'll like speak Japanese. Maybe not Tony Loy. No, <laughs> <but>. <laughs> wait, wait, it's because like your argument yeah, is like so like because you're you I said feel like you're just grasping onto anything it's because you, you said that like you use Bad Bunny Bad still an example, but Bad Bunny is rap way in Spanish. In Spanish. Spanish, right? Where did he get that? You weren't influence? sure for a second. Huh? <laughs> you weren't sure for a no, second. No, I want to hear him say yes, but he didn't say yes, okay. so I had to repeat myself. Okay, yes. You got a yes for me. Yeah. So as you see, like, okay, look, it is becoming into rap, but yet they're making it into their own style. Well, I don't think it's going to become rap. It's just going to become like, it's just going to be musica mexicana. Like, no, va a ser okay. musica mexicana. Wait, no, 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 it's not going to be. Wait, okay, what become. do you consider rap? Speaking fast? Well, he thinks he's gonna go into rap. No, 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 no. <laughs> I wanna, I wanna see his point of, of rap. What, no, what wait. do you consider rap? Speaking fast? No, just like the style of music. K- kind of like the. What mi- is it? What, what style of music? Okay, okay, like let me use an I can, example. I can, yeah, yeah, I can listen an, to a. Let me use an example. Uh, like, let's just fuck, say. I can listen to Beatles and be like, oh, that's rap because they're speaking fast in a song. But that's, they don't. that's my boy. But let's just say like back then, like Chalino, right? <laughs> Chalino, and then now JD when he yeah. sings like. Rick Flair, can I buy that van? Like drill corridos type of shit. Drill is like still drill. like rap. That's crazy. Yeah, but like drill from other countries. But anyway. but also you got. But what do you consider rap? You I didn't answer the question. You just no, said. you just I compared just JD, it. and that's it. Yeah, I just said why. No. Did I just say? It? Well, I consider rap whatever Santa Fe Clan is doing. I think rap. Get this well. <laughs> <laughs> rap. No, what do you consider rap? I because a lot it. of people could like. Okay, but just say what you no, think. No, so I, so I think I think rap. So Drake is, is rap or is, is that pop? It's like pop. Drake is both. Oh well, yeah, like he goes both ways because it it, it mixes so much way. Like literally, it's because Drake just goes for like whatever song is gonna be like trending or whatever. Like okay, it's think like, okay, there you go, trending right? The I'm on your the side. Fa- no, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. But the fast the fast speaking is is trending. That's why JD hopped on. Oh, JD was always fucking. Speaking fast. So what? What's your thing about pop? What's the difference for you? What's the difference between pop and rap? Pop and rap. I don't really listen to pop. But that that that's like that's so separate. So you don't listen what? to Drake. No, this is, you're I like don't. separating from the point that don't. You're, you're trying to prove. <laughs> yeah. How? Well, you made me remember a cool story. Because you, we're basically saying that a rap is coming from English, and Spanish music is turning. Into rap, which is, which is English. Am I, you get where I'm coming from? I think you got confused. I think. Oh, like the last what, Okay, but got confused. Remember, got confused. remember, too, like, I think we asked Legado as well. We asked a lot of artists, do you think the music's turning into rap? And they said yes, right? Yeah, they said yeah. So, like, them as musicians, I feel like they also see it, like, turning into rap. Like, it's not the same as it was before. Like, cuando me muera. Come on, mm-hmm. and then now it's just like Ric Flair. Yeah, I mean, well, I mean, you also got to talk about like the the language too, like how you said that English is like okay, being but look, taught everywhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But no matter, <laughs> yeah, let's the do language. this. Let's do this. But these guys grew up basically speaking English the whole life. Who, like JD, fucking half of the new like artists, they grew up speaking English, right? I don't know. Yeah. Well, let's just say yes because that's what their okay. style says. Yeah. 
So obviously well, they came up with like a they, new style. They they listen to rap. They listen to Spanish music. Yeah, that's so. Then why don't they sing in English if they want to change rap so much? No, not that they want to change it, but they're just getting influenced but, by rap. But what are they singing? They're not trying to Spanish, change it right? to rap. Yeah, oh, I think they're they're just getting, like but they're singing in Spanish, right? Yeah, that's what I said. They're not trying to change to rap. They're just getting influenced to rap. A ver, Keiko, what was the what was the question that we're arguing about? That mm-hmm. supposedly Spanish. That Spanish is taking over English. rap. No, he said no. English music, right? What? <laughs> no, no. This argument was about Spanish music taking over rap music. I was talking about corridos, Spanish corridos, obviously, because they're Spanish rap. We started with Spanish corridos. That's why you said corridos. It's the same shit. The corridos are... Bec- you're saying corridos are becoming into rap, no? That's what your argument been the whole time. I said getting influenced by... No, because... No, my, you my, literally no, said... No, you my, literally my said... Argue- play it back. No. You literally said... <laughs> my argue- no, you literally said... It was going like... Oh, oh, it's becoming into rap. It's becoming... Now you're changing... Now you're saying they got influence. Yeah, that's why. Tur- okay, well, do you agree it's turning into rap? You said this like you say this every episode. But you said that yeah, too. Yeah, the new that's generation why. You're getting influenced by rap. But is and you're saying no. My argument that wasn't what I first said. My first argument. You first said my okay. First, my first argument. Why are you changing it? No, then? Listen, why are you listen, changing listen, it? Listen, every listen. single time you listen, Linda, say listen, something Linda. Different. Listen, listen. My argument. Shut up, Toby. It, <laughs> my my argument is that you said <laughs> that uh, Mexican because we're just talking about corridos. You know, we're this is like talking about regional. Yeah, right? regional. Mm-hmm. Remember you said that that's mm-hmm. gonna be. Bigger than rap. Yeah, it is. Like Drake and shit like that. Yeah, it is. But then you also said that they don't teach Spanish everywhere, but they teach but English. They, don't, they do. Te- they do? Or, or now they do? They sp- they teach English everywhere. Yeah, so how can the Spanish, like, corridos, like... It doesn't matter. You don't have to listen. You don't have to, I don't think you have to speak the language. You don't, but the majority of people will rather listen to something they understand, right? That's how it gets big. That's what how... English music and English culture or rap culture has gone into the extent that it is because it's being taught in English. other countries. No, because well, no, then it gets catchy. I don't know. I feel bad backing so, you up, but... <laughs> <laughs> Even that fool said he feels bad no, backing can't, you. Can't. So, but, like, you think a lot of people, like, rather list... Like, well, a lot of people... You think, okay, music let's put it this understand. way. Th- let's put it this way. You're not wrong. Let's way. Put, this okay. shit is growing, on, but like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's put growing. it this way. It's growing. The new generation, Gen Z, whatever you fucking call this generation, what are they considered as? Gen Z? No, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> see, 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 see. Yeah, but um, like, to, yeah, to the other Hispanic people, what are they considered as? No sabos. There you go. Because their first language is not Spanish, it's English. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But they're adapting to the Spanish, um, what's that shit called? The, yeah, but like, it like, with the like, age. like they're bringing their own flavor into it. And like how Herencia Patrones did it, they brought the... Like the rap flavor into it, mm-hmm. but they kept the Spanish. Yeah, because if they just did, like the rap and English, like it's not Mexican music. They wouldn't consider. Yeah, that's why. But they're bringing it into the Hispanic side, which eventually all the new no sabo or whatever you want to call them, once they start getting older, obviously the younger people, their their sons, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, it's gonna be changing. Et cetera, et cetera. Well, what, what, what do you mean it's gonna be changing? Into more of the Hispanic side. Cause you're saying okay, rap is popping now. So you're, wait, so you're but saying yeah. rap is catchy, like yeah. So you're saying like the like let's see when we get older, our kids will be listening to the same music we listen to. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, which is Spanish, right? Mm-hmm. It's like we're kind of like the same thing. That's kind of like because we're right Mexican, now. so we listen to Spanish music. Yeah, but we, we, what about like in South Korea and shit like that? When the kids grow up and they listen to like Drake, didn't you just hear me fucking take, right? you think <laughs> Yeah, but. <laughs> people hear people hear the no sabo they're gonna no, they, but we're they grew about, up they grew up we're talking about but there's war, a lot right? of people there's a lot of people who didn't fucking grow up in a hispanic area but yet sp- speak fucking perfect spanish and fucking but you know we're talking about world, world, world yes yeah, it can't be this fucking worldwide every episode they drag it on like he doesn't want to admit i don't know doesn't why this bitch doesn't nothing. even back me up because you, 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 you don't want to no, prove no, a point no, wrong no because like dude like I know, I know what you're trying to like, I know what you're trying to say, but the mo, the language that's more dominant is always going to be more dominant way, and that's English. Nah, but 
No, like, I'm telling you guys, it doesn't have to be that you have to speak the language because I seen you don't, you don't. Okay, don't. look, but you don't you speak don't, Chinese, I'm right? You wait, up. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, I know you're back. No, 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 let, let him finish. Let him finish. But wait, him finish. I want to, I want to prove him a point. No, wait, no, I just want to no. prove you. Li- you don't speak Japanese, right? No, no. And but he yet, doesn't listen to but, Japanese music but, either. But yet you learn the small phrase that Bad Bunny had, right? No, because no, it was okay. catchy. That doesn't okay. mean he listens okay. to Japanese. No, okay. no, I'm not. I'm not, I'm not saying. I'm not saying. I'm not saying he listens to it. I'm just saying he's backing you up, and you don't even let him talk. I mean, you're right, wait, but you caught onto it, right? It was getting catchy. That doesn't mean he listens to Japanese music. I'm not saying he does. It's just a piece of a song. But it got catchy, and then he started singing to it. And now you love Japanese. No, open. Eres tan pendejo. Okay, wait, 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 <laughs> like little by little, <laughs> it starts catching on to people, and then obviously, I mean, yeah, you never know. I what get, about if on I on the side he he wants to get into fucking <laughs> Japanese shit? You never know. <laughs> then, yeah, I mean, because hey, then it goes not. into hey, wait, English let me, people. Let me back you up. They, they watch, let me back they, you up. Wait, relax. They, English Calma people. Out, they watch. Out. They watch anime. No, what is that Japanese <laughs> shit? <laughs> <laughs> you can get anything into a room. Hey, hey, no, 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 no. no, no. Let me back him up. Let me back him up. No. He's okay. like, next thing you're going to start reading the books like out the other way, like the yeah. Japanese. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, like you're not wrong. No. Way, but like, but like, I'm not going to fucking, like, it is in- intriguing, but like, obviously because I'm a fan of Bad Bunny, you know? But he's not going to start singing in Japanese. <laughs> no, I'm not saying and he is. is he. What I'm saying is that. Little that, little parts. Okay, you got get, fifteen seconds. Little parts <laughs> get catchy, <laughs> so then people can start liking it and start fucking listening to it so more. We, so we need and then we evolve need, and evolve okay, okay, and okay, listening okay, okay. to fucking other shit. So we need okay some some Japanese icon to start singing in Mexican, so their their people could come to our culture. That's what you're trying to say, because that's what Bad Bunny did. Bro, I'm lost. I'm lost too. <laughs> but just answer his question. No, I I understand the question. You didn't? No. So he's saying that there needs to be a Japanese icon who writes in Spanish so our culture could, could get bigger, right? That's yeah, because that's what you're trying to say, that Bad Bunny, like, he no. did it in Japanese. So now I'm intrigued no. by... Yeah, what? okay. You yes can put no? it that way. You can put it that way. You can put it that way. But what I'm saying is that stuff gets catchy. Like, someone could be listening to a fucking Echale Telin and be like, oh, what the fuck? Like, the what? That Echale Telin? Esotelin. Esotelin, yeah, Esotelin. <laughs> Esotelin or fucking yeah, Espanol, La Chona or JD. They can listen to an uh, English person can listen to a JD shit and be like, damn, that, that flows bad. And then they, they look into it. They're listening to more songs. And then the next thing you know, they're on their playlist. But that's their flow. Poco a poco, poco a poco. Flow, poco flow. a poco. Yeah. But still, then just they like, start. Just like Gangnam start. Style. It's okay, but what's your point? What's your point? Concise it, please, for us, because we can't. That, that this little song. by little, the English culture is going to start adapting to like. Spanish? Yeah. Because, like you're saying, it's becoming into rap, but yeah, it's still in Spanish. It's not in English. But I don't think it's like rap, rap. It's just more like. The flow. In, like, yeah. English in general. Influence. That's why I'm saying like about flow like, like, like it's gonna it's that's why I'm saying that the Hispanic music the new music right now is gonna overpass overcome or overpass whatever you say I think so that because rap like that that's what reg- my reg- point reg- been reg- the whole reg- time wait so you and we had to take it over fucking the whole shit wait you said you don't think so did you say you don't think so earlier no he said I think so I think so I don't think it's gonna be like reggaeton and that stuff like I think that stuff's already like this and this with english like pop and like drake whatever yeah okay like for like, example reggaeton is one because thing they, and then rap is one thing because i was gonna say i seen stories where but, i don't know whose story it was but no but uh, they, they were playing like english music in like some other country i forgot which one it was but they don't speak english so it's like they don't have to listen to the language it's just kind of like the vibe and i feel like reggaeton is just gonna take over like the whole entire world but we were talking about like i mean it, look yeah. si vas a mexico, wait, but i don't know stores, if like a corrido st- could like do that like in so stores, you agree with me Cause we're talking about corridos. We're not talking about like reggaeton but or something. Wh- what is the new music turning into? Like you were saying, it's turning into rap, no? You disagree with me then. So it is turning into rap? Yeah, but it's going to overpass them. And oh, then you're okay. like, no, okay. this, this, this. Like you what? always okay. want to... Relax, relax, relax. What? <laughs> what is going to overpass what? Like corrido way. The new okay, corridos no, right no, now. I don't even know those words. Corridos is going to overpass... Rap. 
the like what's hitting right now. What okay? Like con. Let, let's okay, do this. Let's do this. No, no, pete, pete. no, no, no. Because you can. How come no, there's no? Okay, me, me, so like, rap. No, no, okay. You listen wait, to me. Wait, no, wait, 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 no, wait, 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 wait. No, I don't want to. I don't want to fix one piece. I don't want to fix one piece. I'm not listening to him. I speak into the mic. You have headphones. Take them off if you don't want to listen to. All right, go, go. No, okay. What is this music considered? Corridos or what? Yeah, we're talking about corridos. Corridos. Okay, then that's all. I just want to get right because <laughs> I said one thing. You're like, you're like, it's dead. Wait, so go back yeah. to what you said. Corridos <laughs> no, will be said rap. Yeah, you said corridos, right? Mm -hmm. What? Oh, yeah. we'll go continue, on, finish, finish what you were gonna say. Because you said, nah, que go, cuando tú quieras. No, que go said corridos will be uh, rap. You said narco corridos, and then narco, said, yeah. narco corridos? No, okay, no, like, corridos, just, corridos. Yeah, cor like the ones right yeah, now. Yeah, corridos, this, corridos. This Look, it's not generation. gonna overpass it because it's not like as commercialized. Like, you could play like pop music or English, like in any store, like as a background music or whatever, like anywhere in the world, and like that's cool, but. Like or it could like you could put it like anywhere and like it's alright, but like corridos and like Mexican music is more. As you mean, you could play rap or you could play pop. What? No, because the store you're not gonna walk into a store and listen to Pop Smoke or fucking Wait. fucking. Uh, <laughs> you're like dodging and, uh, all these fucking. No, it's because he's saying that you could put rap into any grocery store and no, it could no, be I'm fine. It's commercialized. More like commercialized, like like look. They're not. They put pop. They don't put rap, bro. But if you already have like your argument like super cemented into your brain, like why no, are you even arguing? It's because I'm saying you're saying that commercialized as in rap. It's it. <laughs> oh, whatever you said, it's pop. Pop bro, is the one that rap is very, very more commercialized compared look, to corridos. Okay, what was okay, the first okay. question? The question was. Is corridos gonna turn into rap? No, no, uh, no. Corridos gonna beat rap. That's yeah. What he said. The, but I think a better question would have been like Spanish no, music. But he, like, no, he's saying corridos, not Spanish music. That's why I'm proving my point. He's saying corridos, not reggaeton. Not no, it's because like Mexican corridos pop. is more like. Yeah, exactly. Like, what do you call it? Like, more niche, I guess. Yes. Okay, but. but okay, go. Finish. Finish. Dude, <laughs> dude turn off his mic. Quédale, <laughs> <laughs> gana, no, no, okay, Corridos bro. is more like, like a niche thing, like. It's a small yes, group. Yes, he's corridos. But bro. let's say like, like uh, rap, it's more like out there everywhere. Like there's a more chance of you listening to, to like some rap song than like a corrido. That is not like Spanish people, you know? Exactly. We're, like I said, we're not talking it's about more like commercialized. Bad like, bunny. It's, it's a way bigger thing. We're talking about corridos. Still, they're gonna uh, overcome it. Because <laughs> what did the what did the no sabo community start listening to first? Rap corridos. Okay, no, okay, oh, like, the, the, well, why, why, okay, why, why aren't they like no, no argument. English kids? Like, why aren't they fucking something like that? What? Your bitch. <laughs> Wait, if out. you're saying, yeah, I play no, the fifth, yeah, I play the fifth, yeah, que es la verdad. <laughs> well, anyway, like, now that we're over this argument that nobody agreed to. Now no, I think it's good though because, I mean, that's the point of a podcast. Wait, and I feel like, Dude, la verdad. Have, you guys, have you guys ever seen a podcast where you got this guy going, you guys, got a guy like that going crazy? Yeah, our fans in the comments. And that's what they lost. But look at, look at. Cállate, por favor, déjame hablar. Jesús bendito, deja ya. See, that's what I felt. That's how I felt. I was like, yeah, cállate. Shut up my mic, I dare you. All right, guys. Yeah, you did. All right, guys. Guys, look. Comment down below. I mean, my. All right, guys. Go to the next one. Go to the next one. Guys. 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 Grab a city. Comment. Comment down below. Fuck it. Turn on the camera! Turn on the camera! Drop him! No! Come back! Come back! Come back! Come back! Go! You good? You good, Piff? And then move. Oh my God! You good? That shit was hey, funny hey, as fuck. Oh shit, what the fuck? Where's the seat? Right there, right there. There you go. Oh, they're all off. Damn. No, no, no. <laughs> all right, all right. This is what's going to happen. Keiko, you're going to say what you're going to say. Yeah, yeah. To, to, but to you, were, it, to you were right where you were talking to. No, I said we should just end it like that. No, right there. That no, was no. Funny Let me way. just let's ask the fans so they can comment down below. Oh, wait, just, so, wait, cut, um, cut this part out. No, I'm not going to cut it out. You're chilling. All right, guys. Okay, so what, I'm going to ask what Keiko was going to ask. Do you guys wait, think... Testing, testing. Wait, first let me say... This is what I like you about good? the podcast, because it's like... Wait, we know, all have different opinions. Have different opinions. That's the point. Why the fuck can I hear shit? 
<laughs> it's not plugged in. I know. That's why. Chill, fucking breathing like a fucking football player and shit. <laughs> That's interesting. All, All right, right guys, good. comment down below. Do you guys think corridos, corridos, not reggaeton, shit, corridos, corridos will be bigger than rap? Yes. Look, comment down below. I, I unfortunately, mean, no. Unfortunately, no, but I feel like. You guys could have fucking bagged me up in the beginning. No, 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 no. I I knew he was wrong, but like. <laughs> he, he, this motherfucker was brainstorming the whole time just so we could like, add another fucking hour. No, no, no. That way, that way, No, 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 no. But like the whole point of like. Of this whole thing is to grow, to grow the corridos and, yeah. you know, to grow like whatever you want to call it, you know, this little movement. I feel like things like, you know, podcasts or like other people doing like interviews, other people doing like like different types of content with artists it's only gonna make it grow like if you think about it um like this r the rap music had shit like mtv and then like what do we have Augusto papa yes sir and that's my point <laughs> no but yeah like um and what is that hispanic right yeah obviously the whole point is to grow the culture and make it as big as possible so you know it could be commercialized yeah, like, like we were saying like we like what Keiko was saying, I hope that happens. I hope corridos will one day be way bigger than rap and like we're gonna try our best. All the yeah, but like you know, corridos. Remember, not like reggaeton or Spanish pop, like fucking rebelde and shit. Like corridos. Yeah. Yo soy reverde. He said, "Yo soy reverde." Do you guys agree with Keiko or do you guys agree with the three of us? Let us know. Wait, but bitch, you turn your back on me? It's because you started saying pin the house. Like I can't back this fool up. <laughs> Wait, you're did, you're did on you, you, you you're could, on their side or you're on my side? I I was trying to back you up, but you didn't let me. Then talk. don't say he's on your side, bitch. So wait, okay, so Angel I will tried. answer last. No, Do you it's think because he said he he was, that you were on their side, but you're on my side okay, the whole time. Okay, let's ask him. Let's just ask him. You just say yes or no. Do you think corridos will be bigger than rap? Habla ahorita, calla para siempre. No, but I wish it was. Uh, yes like the same shit as i said i know but i hope one day yeah i think just that the real answer or why that maybe is in a that, few is that companies like spanish companies like mexican companies they're not at the same level to be able to commercialize like everywhere the same way that like english okay like english company in english record labels like the mexican record labels yeah honestly you know? think about it corona <laughs> is a beer company but when oh, i think it's the crude ones no, Corona, like, yeah. When have they ever got a singer that's corrido in a commercial? Nah, they got Bad Bunny, though. Exactly. Bad Bunny, he's a reggaetonero. Yeah, but not corrido. Not corrido. And, yeah. then, and being commercialized from a Mexican. Yeah. Mexican. Yeah. From that standpoint, like, Spanish. Like, like they were like. Corrido music, regional music. It's just not at that level yet. But hopefully, soon, <laughs> one day, it reaches that level. Hell yeah. Sorry, Gecko. In a few, hopefully, in a few generations. And when that happens, Keiko's gonna be right. Yep. Mm. And hey, this shit's gonna be like history. Like, and <laughs> if that happens, don't say you're gonna do something because you're not gonna do. He's that. gonna tattoo Keiko's name right here. I will tattoo your name. No, you're not. If it happens, if like you know, corridos end up beating. They will. The rap music. <coughs> I hope, but we hope, and that's the goal to make this. Like as of right now, we should argue like, well, you should have said like, oh, well, corridos be reggaeton. That's like more. No. No. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. but let us know down below. We have also, a, wait, before, wait, also before, um, we have a Q and A. Do you guys want to see it for the next episode? We got. Oh yeah, that's it. <laughs> oh, but also, get went underground November twelfth. Make sure to pull up. We're gonna be there. We're gonna be there. We're gonna talking. host it. We're gonna bien. host it. So we're gonna be on stage. Make sure you go there. You know, Marco okay. Mapes gonna be there. Magallito, claro que sí, is gonna be there. Jose Morales. Bajo perfil. Bajo perfil. Ciclan. Make sure you and know, so that you can see like, Polo how nervous I get. Uh, all I know to hero. Should we just answer like a few? Like at least yeah, let's let's hit it. I think we can fit in. And let's also it. stay to the end of the thing because I have an uh, end of end of video club story for you guys. Oh, okay. That JD told me. Hold on, we're gonna go on a break. Alright guys, we're back from the break. My bad for Alright, well, Angel Space. <laughs> oh yeah. This was like suffocating. <laughs> <laughs> like Jack Black. You can push it if you want. Yeah, you really. <laughs> <a smoke break. laughs> Sorry, Keiko was on a smoke break. Look, hey, uh, Angel made a really good like point, point that could have break. could have summarized literally everything or well, their argument. I think you should state it. Our argument. Stop. stop what is stop it? Like that bitch. 
fucking the commercialized you know, shit. Yeah. Oh yeah, that that it would get there, and Keiko would be right that corridos do get to that level. But what is holding it back? I think it's like the the Spanish companies are just like not there yet with English ones and how commercialized they like they try because I think they just try to fill up like the shows. You know, they're not trying to get their songs like played out like a Super Bowl or something like that commercials or like on a Netflix episode or something yeah like so that. stuff like that like they're they're not quite there yet unfortunately or on a, on a movie and you think since like they haven't tried that's why it uh, won't happen look, look at him when he's talking to you don't fucking look at me oh. Oh, I'm just ready <laughs> to see like que tontería vas a decir oh I wasn't paying attention good <laughs> <laughs> alright let's do the Q&A there's a lot of questions I hope we can get through all of them First one, we got to answer this one. What's one of the biggest struggles you guys face when uploading to social media and being public? Oh, man. Can you repeat the question, sir? <laughs> what is one of the biggest sh- struggles you guys <laughs> face when uploading to social media and being public? <laughs> being Posting on social media and being public in terms of the group account or individually? Both. I feel like there's no, there's no struggles, I feel like. Oh... Maybe, oh yeah, I think that there's one thing. I mean, it's not a struggle. We don't see it as a struggle, but I just feel like one of the things that, I don't want to say sucks, but like since we're a podcast, a podcast is supposed to be like, kind of not arguing, but like kind of what we had right now. Like there's- Discussion. Um, like we have, I discussions. Think we, I think we have a good team. Like we always mentioned this too, that like Gekko's an outlier and he doesn't agree with us. But mm-hmm. like, I like that because of that, yeah. we're able to talk. Because imagine if we all agreed to some we're shit. Like, would, uh, it would just be like that. Corridos are going to take over the whole entire world and that's all we're going to listen to like in the next yeah, five like, years. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, yeah, like, let's we go. Won't, we won't be able to talk. And also, I feel like yeah. the podcast too is all about opinions and like everyone has different opinions. So like if someone doesn't agree with your opinion, like... It's okay, you know? Yeah, like it's okay. But you know, sometimes like I'll be like, ah, oh, like, you know, last episode, like that paragraph about Kiko, like, oh, he's fucking stupid. But you know, like it's his opinion. Yeah, yeah. You know, you, know, you can't. But like, they'll take it like if it's like, Damn. Like, yeah, yeah, you're right. Like we argue all the time on and off camera, but yeah. yeah. <laughs> the only difference is that when we're arguing here, the cameras are turned on, but we always argue. Yeah, we we're arguing before yeah. the episode too. Yeah. yeah, he's really grumpy. For like a whole that's something you guys gotta grumpy. know about him. You're not grumpy. But you guys agree with me that like, that's true. Like, yeah. I mean, but that's like the point of a podcast too. We can't all agree to some shit. Yeah, discussion. Like, I, I'm glad Keiko doesn't agree with us all the time. Yeah, he stays by his stupid opinion. <laughs> <laughs> he sticks to. He's loyal. So he's ladies loyal. out there watching, look. Like, He'd be a lo- he'd be he's gonna be loyal to you like uh, he is to his uh I'm a loyal arg- but still single. Dumb arguments. What's <laughs> everyone's favorite current favorite group? I think my right now Luis R. Conriquez. Yeah. I think I'm still with Marca Registrada. Re- oh yeah. Damn. I actually Damn, changed. I, I had a little juniors for like a couple weeks, but now yeah, you burned them. Need son especial? That's oh, right. Not more. You? Marca Registrada. I've been listening to a lot of like uh Wait, it has to be in Spanish or anything? Group food doesn't say Mexican or, oh, sp- or English. I've been listening to a lot of Polo G, the rap. But Polo Gonzalez, he's hard too. No, he's Giovanni su equipo armado. That's yeah. what's called. Yeah, I found out about him like two days ago. And shout out to you guys, some bangers. What is the worst thing that has happened to y'all? No cap. Damn. Like. Personally, and they're in the podcast. Personally, both. I mean, whichever has been worse. Nah, because I'm gonna start crying right now. <laughs> the worst thing what? that happened to me. Um. Oh, we thought about it quick. Oh, I know what's the worst thing that happened to you when you didn't press record during like those episodes, so it came out bad, and everyone thought of our question. And we had so to redo the whole episode, so and they wanted to leave, but they stayed, and we still did. So we had yeah. to improvise while we filmed the whole two-hour episode. And people yeah. thought we sucked. And in. they had to ask the questions twice. Not twice. <laughs> Not twice, but <laughs> correct. We had to no, improvise. Right. We had to improvise. Yeah. And all he said were like, oh shit. What has been your, oh, this is a good one. What has been you guys' is... Not only your worst episode, but like, like, fuck, I wish I could have done better. <laughs> Esteban's. So if you guys are watching this for the next episode, it's going to probably Yours? be Esteban. for you, Esteban? Yeah, I was really nervous. It was the first time I was on with a guest and probably like the third episode ever. <laughs> and I didn't know what to ask. I was nervous. Like I started. Dude, that day he I, had a fucking... See or no? No, 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 no. no. it's because it okay, wasn't like that. No, no, no. Four? It's because it wasn't Oh, where yeah, help y'all. No, my man, you said no like two minutes ago. I wasn't going to be on it. Like, it's not, like, I wasn't on all the episodes, right? I was just, I like, come, right? But I wasn't going to be on it. But then he said, oh, yeah, you should be on it. Like, hop on, like, sit right there. So then that's why I sat down. 
but I wasn't gonna be on it. Like I didn't even come with questions or nothing. You couldn't be like, <laughs> <laughs> look, look, <laughs> look, look. You? Um, oh no, no, we already said yours. Huh? Oh yeah, 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 that was my worst episode. Mine. That was funny. That was funny. What the hell? But I think you be honest because I was I was fucked up. No, that was it funny. Was. But it was fun. Nah, but it was funny, but I didn't remember. I can't shit. stop watching that episode, guys. We'll go watch the. We watch it for episode. fun, actually. He like, was drunk. It's so fucking <laughs> funny. Like, he kind of struck right. Dude, Dude he, he asked the same I, question. Yeah, I can't five remember. Times in th- five different. I can't remember which question it was, but he asked the question, and like the question was like one of those like thirty second questions, and then she answered for like two three minutes. And then literally all he said was the exact same question again after she answered. And like, she didn't, yeah, like, she didn't even call him out. So props to her. She just looked at us and like, we should have her on again. We should. Who is the dream interview? For me, it's La Buena Armado and it's going to happen 100% once we get the new place. For me, it's Junior Achi. Oh, yeah. Junior. Damn. Say it again. Who, Ow, who is the dream interview? Grupo Firme. Mm-hmm. For you, Grupo Firme? That would be a bit. Be popping bottles. Like, bah, 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 bah. You think you'll be able to do good since it's in Spanish? Yeah, by the time we'll have him, I think I'll be fucking good with Spanish. Who has the worst Spanish? Jason. Jason. <laughs> Jason. Well, it was now, you, though. Bro. Now, it used but to be him, but now it's him it's because no salvo, Jason we were recording confirmed. something and he could not get a full sentence in Spanish out of him. He had to go. Mi nombre es Mi nombre Jason. Es? Nunez. Not even. It but I'm gonna. Like that, it was like that. No, mama. The guy that was recording that even told you, you fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. I'm gonna like I thought I was horrible, but. I'll but my dream interview is gonna be El Vos. I really want to hear what he has to say. Oh yeah, appreciate but the cool story. Not dream interview, but I would also like to see what, like, if he was honest, I'd like to see what Jimmy had to say. I don't think we're gonna. Just I'd like to. See. But that's his opinion. Go for next question. One day, I'll happen. Damn. Uh, where the fuck? If Gecko is going to get hit by a rhino, will you guys save him? Fuck it, let the me way. get hit. What the fuck? That's gonna be funny as fuck. A rhino. <laughs> a rhino. I don't know. It was kind of weird. He's like, pero que me de con el cuerno. Gecko is a rhino. I didn't see what I had in tierra. No. I think I just record it, put it on TikTok, go viral. <laughs> Why do y'all bully Gecko so much? We do not. He just gets himself into those situations. Like, he says the dumbest stuff. Like, today, he said, Y'all I don't know this. what he said. And he even said himself right after he was done saying it. No, me entendí ni verga. <laughs> no, not only that, when he first came, he parked backwards on the street. Like <laughs> He's parked backwards like, you know, outside. On the right side, you know, it's like, <laughs> on the right. And he was parked backwards. <laughs> and then he was like, oh, I parked backwards. And then we were just like, why? He's like, that's because? illegal. And I'm like, dude, that's illegal. He's like, really? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> He parked, dude. And he's he parked backwards. He like the worst part. He drives for a living. I know. I know. How do you not know you can't park backwards? Do, do you? I park, park backwards at work. Oh my god! They should take away your the, fucking. It's probably a little different because it's UPS, but like, <laughs> oh yeah. Like no, I know because I saw the car outside and I was backwards. like, isn't that his car? Like, what is it doing backwards? Like he just like, because he parks he really backwards sometimes. So like, I think like. Oh, it's just because we're going to leave in like 30 minutes or some shit. That's what I felt like. You just dropped something off and you're leaving or something. <laughs> it didn't make sense. No, it's because in front of Diego's car, there's a car that looked like yours. So I'm like, a la verga, that was here already? And I'm fucking... Because we said we're going to meet... Yeah, but what did that have to do with you? We, thought, we, said, we said we're going to meet Park correctly. 30 minutes. Like I got stuck in traffic. Yeah, so I was like, wow, like, oh, fuck, I'm already late. Yeah, see in Putis, I came this way. Yeah, see, I saw the first parking, so I met the way, and I just re- got off. If you parked good, Obviously, it would have been, like, it been like 30 seconds more. No, because then I had to do a U turn and then park and then move the trash can. Wait, are you saying you don't know how to drive? Me metí a la verga. Yeah. So I'm a badass driver. Okay, what's the next question? <laughs> you can see from Thursday. How did Keiko get his nickname? Oh, yeah. Oh, I think <laughs> you could explain that. From an Asian, no? What? An Asian guy? Philippine. <laughs> <laughs> a Philippine guy literally just changed your name for the rest of your life. Yeah. How? You should because he couldn't say Diego, couldn't so he would call Diego. him Keiko. Keiko. Yeah. And yeah. I just stayed with him. He lived right here actually. By Don Tomas. You used to go see him. Who the fuck? Oh, is I used Don to live Tomas? there. Oh. Don Tomas. Yeah, the Serenito. Oh, the Don Tomas. Yeah, I know who that is. Yeah. Damn. Well. Uh. Who has the biggest dick from you for? Does he pull it out? I think Angel. All right, does that everyone go pull it out? <laughs> <laughs> Did you say Angel? <laughs> you gay as no! no! That's supposed to be a joke, but you nah, didn't know. Nah, 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 nah,
Hey, they're blowing our cover. They're blowing our cover. That's as fuck. Shut up, dude. That's weird. I told you, don't tell no one. <laughs> you don't now the whole world. That. Now the why, whole world knows why, that's true. Why now you 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 don't fucking go with the joke? No, you said it seriously. Yeah, you said no. it seriously. Angel, he didn't say. He's like, nah, just kidding. He always says, nah, just kidding. But nah. he didn't say shit. Cause then you're supposed to be like, you be like, oh, you see, you guys do shit, but then no, you wanted to play. Okay, the now you guys see what we believe. Mister, Mister, you guys see what he here. says. It's because we can't read your dumbass mind. Wait, like, we don't know when. Like, it's a joke or it's real. <laughs> that was real. Everything's a joke. All right, bad. Next question. What did y'all do before the podcast? Damn. Took a shit. Tried to do YouTube. Took a shit? Oh, you're talking like oh. literally. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I like was before today. <laughs> you're a dumb as fuck, Gekko. <laughs> I knew exactly what you meant, though, because you're actually like, I'll hold up. I'm going to be late. I'm going to take a shit. <laughs> well, because, like, I thought, like, obviously he, they asked the questions today, so I was like, oh, what did you guys do before the podcast? So I was like, oh, shit. Yeah, they meant in general, like, like yeah, in, your life, um, in your life. Like, before, when you yes. had time to do stuff, but what did you used to do? I was a... Oh, well, not was I am. You said you were sending mid, no? Deliver. No, but you were trying to start a record, you know? Oh, uh, yeah. If you guys have talent but or no talent, he'll sign you either way. <laughs> Hit him up. That's fucked up. <laughs> 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 That's fucked up. Nah, bro. Well, I'll probably sign you because you ain't making it to Wait, choir. I, you ain't making it to tennis. About, um, I talk, I, so, Keiko started a record label back then called Gru- <laughs> oh, Grupo Firme. Firme Records. Talk about the percentages. And you know how, like, there's nowadays there's, like, bad percentages? <laughs> Dude. <laughs> like, the artist gets 15. Well, in Keiko's record label, he got 5%. <laughs> and the artist got 95%. I swear to God. And Keiko literally paid, like, and 80% of and the Keiko expenses. He got into debt. We had to, like, we, he had to declare, I'm never in debt. He, he had to declare bankruptcy. <laughs> But I want to applaud you for that because you're <laughs> you were pretty young and you literally this made the record year. Like, was last, this last year. year. <laughs> okay, look at his face, bro. He's like, okay, but you were 21. You literally tried to make your own no, contract. I was 22 already. Nah. I'm trying to help out your face. I'm trying to help out your face. You Damn. know, you know how I can say I I could turn this on, Diego. I sent this bitch to proofread it. Proofread the contract. They didn't send. They didn't it. say shit. I was playing Warzone. Like, and he just said, "Yeah, <laughs> it's <right>. good." <laughs> There was like ten errors. He so, he set me up for failure. So, so <laughs> because no, you he, was, up. he was, was there. CEO, he bitch. was there. You're he the was CEO. there. So okay, go gonna just, <laughs> No, and then look, these two were supposed to be my the founders and helpers. But I pay fucking everything. They used to drive them around. Hey, used to we buy them the food. Employees, motherfucker. No, no, but like, <laughs> so Keiko sent me the contract to like proofread it. And I was playing Warzone and I just I was like, yeah, it's good. And, yeah. Then, and then the day he came like to sign some groups, like I, I saw the contract and it was like five percent. Like, damn, this was not gonna win shit. Okay, but And I asked him, like, is that good? Wait, like, yeah, that's not a my fault. Wait, I know that you were trying. trying. Didn't he spell like contract wrong? <laughs> <laughs> I left out the I left out the T in artist. Oh yeah, artist. <laughs> no, you left out the You spelled a lot of you shit. You left wrong out in the, the talent in artist that you saw. <laughs> Oh. Next anyway, question. Anyway, anyway. anyway. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, but I commend you for your effort. You actually can't come back. And then come back. It is gonna come back. And come back. We're gonna strong. sign some of you guys. I yeah. have all the equipment. Hey, people wanna people be sending you shit too. I think that's dope as fuck. Yeah. I have a lot of equipment now. Yup. My lights. You I can make badass camera. videos. The audio, all that. No, I just Wait, everyone shush. Oh, I thought I heard a buzzing noise. Well, something? wanted y'all to start a podcast, and by the way, kick Gekko out. He talks too much. <laughs> Thank We're you not for being a supporter. Out. Thank you. You have your opinions about me. I appreciate that a lot. Thanks for keeping him in your mind. Thank yes, you. sir. Your thoughts mean a lot to me. We'll answer the first question. We we'll wanted y'all to start a podcast. Well, no one was doing it, so we wanted to do it. And we there did. was a void. And we did a TikTok, and it blew up right away. <laughs> Before the first video even came out. Yep. They everyone was like, where's the first episode? We didn't even have the first one. <laughs> remember? No, we had one set, but then oh, that yeah. shit blew up, so we had a refill. Oh, yeah, we had a refill. I remember. And then, nah, fuck and you were that. in Mexico, too, so yeah. we didn't do that you. Yeah. This who oh. was in Mexico. He f- missed, like, a lot of... The first reports. three episodes. What, what were you was, doing yeah. in Mexico for such a long time? I don't know. On a trip? Actually, no. I was building my house. I died in the end of building. You were building a house in Mexico mm-hmm. that you did not Wait, you were you were the architect mm-hmm. for the house or what? What? I, at least hopefully they didn't make the contract for the house. I don't know. <laughs> no, I had to go to fucking see like 
¿Cómo le van a hacer? Like, read the blueprints and all that shit. You don't even know how to read. I was like, I was like, you were just looking at it like, oh, it's like a Lego. I'm gonna darle, I'm gonna darle. I asked him, were you the architect? He's like, what? He didn't know what that was. But that's why they didn't build it. I know. It would have felt nah, like I didn't build it cause, cause then that's when like that COVID. COVID shit. So a lot of people didn't want to work to work, huh? That's no, just, not work that so when they couldn't have some permits get signed and No, nah, it was bad in Mexico. But I'm going back and get the shit done. Do midgets have night vision? No. Close, your, close your eyes and tell me what you see. <laughs> no seas pendejo, wey. No seas pendejo, wey. I like when he says that. <laughs> Te pasa de verga, wey. Keiko says a lot of funny shit. Like, no mames, wey. He says a lot of bad words. Yeah. No, I don't. I this, one, this one's for you guys. Do you think Jenny69 is bombed? Natural, yeah. Not right now. What? Natural, yeah. I don't like, like, people who do surgery and get implants and you don't like people who do surgery or you're not into people who do surgery I'm not into people who get it done yeah get the their body that, fixed all the girls that were gonna about to hit you up when you said you were single now like all, oh, all these girls <laughs> with bbls fuck damn i can't hit up he got away. Away. oh my he god, god. Away. my ah. life is over i can't hit no way how can there's I get actually a difference it? in between there's two different types of bbls there's one that like they put in the fake nalgas, and then there's the other one where they take the fat out of their stomach and put it into their ass. I, I don't know, but... <laughs> That's the one you should get. How come you haven't done that shit to you? You need to look fit. I don't need nalgas. <laughs> no, like take the fat and put it in your arms or something. No, I should put it into Jason, way, no? Mame. Say, wey, si los necesita. Canica. Canicas. Damn. Um, I think she's kind of pretty. Face-wise, yeah. I, I just but she might not my type though anyway no, no comment <laughs> that's a yes for him <laughs> why does Keiko look Chinese what the hell the chinito damn yeah. Keiko so if that's not if that's not your type what is your type I wanna know I want everybody to know pack se pongan pilas natural 5-4 someone said worst experience with a girl starting with you damn but all those or guy my bad. all those qualities that you were saying that's just exterior like you didn't even say like oh she has to be funny or smart i go for personality <laughs> no you go for that's a butt cap. you know why because there'll be like a girl with the private account and he'll be like hey you seem chill we should hang out like how does seem she seem chill with like a little tiny ass picture just because you saw like personality <laughs> he saw the personality, personality. <laughs> <laughs> Not mm. one. I I don't follow private accounts. Dude, he's so private with like the people he fo- like. I mean, like, what do you call it? If Google has anyway, you up, can you guys please send us a screenshot so we could just read them? No, yes. We won't yes. say who your name is. You want to read my DMs? We'll send you free merch. Nah, because you always if say If Google has hit you up and it's funny, hit us up. We give you free merch. Bet. <laughs> say your worst experience with a girl. Him. Worst experience with a guy. Tell him. That's oh, true. Yeah, 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 like that. Go. Where is this? <laughs> <laughs> the way he said it. Where's the experience? Where's the experience? Um, 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 Whoever um. can answer first. No, I don't have any bad All the experiences have been good. Oh, actually, I had one. Tell us about it. Um, I broke up. I got out of a relationship and then like a month later she was pregnant. Oh yeah. And it wasn't my kid. So you know what that means? <laughs> what? I got cheated on. Damn. Wait, God. how how many months was she pregnant? Sure, yeah, like she was about to have the baby already for <laughs> No. <laughs> like like three. You got cheated on? No that I found out she was pregnant. <laughs> 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 so you got cheated on. So you found out you got cheated on because you saw the the bump answer. No, we were in a relationship. So, lady said him. But, like, three months later. He will never catch him. She? I ain't no girl, bitch. I mean, he. There you go. So, no, I have. But that was my first relationship. I have. (laughs) But, yeah, I have no bad experience or good experience. I have no experience. How about you guys? I I did not know that you were. uh, I didn't know. I I know. I told you guys about that. I I know we had a conversation about that, but I didn't think it was serious. Yeah, cause you you say cause you you, you always say shit like messing around, but like yeah. but it's oh, cause no, you didn't say that she was like already like months pregnant. Like, I think 
Well, for, I, I didn't know way, until the, three the, months after we broke up. Yeah, but the way you said it was like, oh, we broke up, and then one month later, she got pregnant. No, no, he, she, he found out she was pregnant. So that's how he found out that he got Yeah, but I thought, on. like, she, just, like, got pregnant. Oh, no. Like, later on, you know, like, one month later, like, and that was the thing that she got pregnant fast. But she was already <laughs> pregnant. Damn, that's all good. Okay. But good thing with my kid, right? Yeah, you're right. Then I should be taking all my benefits. <laughs> <laughs> you are just going to take half off, half off braces. Half off braces. <laughs> half off braces. It's not half off. It's like... He's like, no, no she trapped breaks. me. She took my half off braces. Gecko flexes his benefits. It's so funny. He flexes on us because we don't have like a real job, so we got no benefits. We're toughing it out here. <laughs> A ver si no nos enfermamos porque si no, <laughs> we're gonna have to hey, hey, hey. living on we, a budget. And when we were, we were going to Hawaii, it's like you guys dude, he had, he was having the time of his life. Yeah, oh, when we like went to go get COVID get tested, we, you guys might get billed six hundred dollars for the test. I was like, no, like, what and the then fuck? it's like, oh, okay, for you, Keko, that you have insurance, it'll be five. Mm -hmm. You yeah. gotta pay five dollars. Yeah, but we never got billed. So but you know I mean, what happened? I never, got, I never paid it. So what happened was that you had to pay five dollars copay, and we never had to pay nothing. No, I actually didn't pay the five dollars. I don't know, believe you. We're at 23 minutes, wait. Oh, really? Uh -huh. Just keep going for a little bit. I bet, go. Check it out, we'll ask the next yeah, question. What's the next question? No, that's what I'm looking for. That's what I'm letting you guys talk. Yeah. Ask Gecko, why is he so dumb? Gecko, why is he so dumb? Just kidding. I'm not <laughs> dumb. <laughs> Just everybody thinks their own way. Damn, he's a, he's a man of his own kind. I'm he's unique. like the, he's like You have like a whole little city inside your brain. I'm unique, so ladies hit me up. Ask <laughs> You can't have a BBL though or any like plastic Yeah, surgery. but please make sure you're natural because that's what he likes. <laughs> Damn. Se pasa. Como que, I remember. Uh, como que te vieras como para poder escoger. Okay, I got a question. A la verga que sí. What? If you like personality, wait, my my What is what? A la verga that's eso. Dude, we asked him and all he said was like, oh, she's got to be like 5'4". She's got to have a big ass. Like, no. That's all he said. He didn't say nothing about personality. Okay, when you, when you look at a girl, what is the first thing you notice? Like you just see a girl. Eyes. So eyes and matter cap. a lot, dude. That's cap. cap. Yeah, cap. no, we're horny ass dog. We make eye contact. You're a horny ass dog. Because <laughs> I feel like I, when when I look at a girl, I feel like I always uh, I always look at the teeth and the nose. Yeah, you always see that. And the eyebrows, and I see. And the personality. <laughs> Jacob's not that person who's like personality first. We all know that's fucking cap. It is. It's like, he's about to say it's not. It's not cat. Yeah, it's like, that's that's Show me your tits. <laughs> <laughs> no. Hell yeah! I saw, <laughs> your, I, saw your, you I saw your DMs. Say, like, I saw your DMs. It doesn't like, matter because we're not going to be talking either <laughs> way. <laughs> my DMs are not like that. <laughs> you want to see my DMs? I'll show me. <laughs> he he like, right, let, will you let me hold the phone? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. exactly. He's just gonna do that shit where he just scrolls up all, all fucking fast. Yeah, yeah. He always no, you know, you know. If why? this gets a thousand thumbs up, we're gonna post a screenshot of like Gecko's. <laughs> Someone already exposed oh. you in high school. Wait. You, you yeah. like, he's such a horny <laughs> dog that he's been exposed. That was high school. Twice. Twice. He's been exposed. And then he hit up that girl after dude, high school, dude. and he was like, "Hey, I'm a changed man. Let's start from the beginning." <laughs> no. A hundred percent confirmed. A hundred percent confirmed. And now she's in my DMs. Look, 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 yeah. look, look. He's about to say, well, yeah, now she DM. hit me up. She is. She's in my DMs. What's no. Up? He's about to, all she said was probably like, I'm going to expose you another time if you don't like stop <laughs> swiping up on my stories. <laughs> That's how she's in your DMs. I thought you were going to let us see the DMs. Oh, yeah. It go down in the DM. It go oh, down. You, wait, wait, will you let us hold the phone? No. Because oh, no. the last time... <laughs> Someone went through Keiko's phone. The shit. last time this motherfucker went through my phone. That was your daddy. I told this. Thing. <laughs> Did you hit up was Grupo Firme for a shout out? Oh, no. That, I tagged them in the. Oh. Hopefully they see it. Maybe they see it. All right, guys. Who's going to do the outro? We have to upload this episode like in two days. <laughs> it's Saturday. It's like 12 we in the morning. So basically Sunday. And this video has to be up tomorrow. We put it in the work. We put in the work. If you guys are watching to the end. Shout Honestly, out. if you're watching till the end, like I'm gonna invite you to Keko's wedding, and I'm gonna invite you better to his birthday party. Honestly, if you're seeing this, and you and you're single, and you and you fit his description of what he's looking for, no, <laughs> DM me so you get invited. You get invited because he's not gonna know about it. It's gonna be a surprise. Comment down. End of the video club. End of the video club. If you saw this, you're invited. Hit me up for the Addy. Not him though, because he doesn't know. It. Peace out, guys. <laughs>